Okay, now on the worksheet B, question number five, how do we actually differentiate this bit? So now let's say we got, uh, we need to find the dy over dx of y equals root five or the part question B. So let me just pick up a question. If I do the question number H, it has all the variables. So it will be, you will be able to do the other one. So let's start with the question number H. Now let's say for question number H, I got y equals, Eight root x plus four over three x square. Now, first thing is, I'm I can rewrite this this bit as eight. I'm not differentiating yet. Eight x to the power half because square root is actually a half plus four over 3. I cannot bring the 3 up. I can only bring the x up. x to the power minus 2. Now once I got this bit, I need to actually differentiate that bit. So to differentiate this bit, if I rewrite this thing, y equals 8x to the half. So I'm just copying the previous one. Plus 4 over 3x minus 2. Let's check if I copy it right. Yeah, that's right. Okay, now I need to differentiate. So then we write down differentiate with respect to x. And then I'm just going to do dy over dx here. And I will do dy, d over dx on the other side. Now I need to differentiate the each in the, uh, entity separate. This is one term, this is another term. So I need to differentiate both of them separately. So let's do that one. So d over dx of 8, uh, let's remove the bracket and put a different bracket, 8x to the half plus d over dx of 4 over 3x minus 2. Now I need to differentiate this term. Then I need to differentiate that term. Let's do that on the next one. The first one, when I differentiate the 8, which will come out already, and I need to differentiate x to the power half. Up to you if you want to put the half outside the bracket or inside the bracket. Uh, plus 4 over 3 comes out just because it's a constant. So constant comes out and x minus 2, d over dx of x minus 2. Now the next step, the 8 is there, that dot in multiply, this power comes out. So half, and then you reduce the power by 1, x half minus 1, plus... 4 or 3 is already out. Yep. Minus 2 comes out. I'm putting minus 2 in brackets so you don't confuse that one as a subtraction sign. And reduce the power by minus 1. Minus 2, minus 1. So that will 8 divided by 2. That's the 4. I got the 4. And the x, half minus 1 is minus half plus 4 over 3, uh, rather 4 over 3, if I do 4 times minus 2, 4 times minus 2 is actually a minus 8, minus 8 over 2, and that's x, minus 2 minus 1 is minus 3, so this is your dy over dx. And that's the yes. Sorry, that was supposed to be three, not two. 
thank you so this is uh three yeah thank you okay